Okay, my name's Conor McCardle. I work for Ulster Carpet Mills and I'm a weaver. Basically maintaining uh, the looms and generally running off the loom. And that the loom generally runs without any problems. To make sure that the carpet that comes off each loom is fault free. And I wouldn't say it's an overly hard job, but not somebody can just walk in off the street and do it. Just basically applied for the job. Got the job as a creeler within the factory here. That's sort of supplying the wool to the back of the looms. And then within 11 months I was a weaver. 12 months, 12 months training and then basically you learn something new every day with it. I started with a factory, started creeling for the firm. And the more I was around the back of the loom, I got round to the front of the loom. And other experienced weavers would have showed me, you know, bits of their jobs. And I just gradually picked up things from there. And the working end of the factory, I suppose, weavers are as high as you can go, sort of. You know, the next stage would be sort of up into the management the end of it. I like getting on with the boys I work with, you know. You sort of, you can't be too friendly with the boys um, if you're dishing out the orders. <laughs> oh, definitely, it is a team situation, yeah. Great, they're a great bunch of lads. So they are. Everybody helps everybody. So they, there's no end team. <laughs> I'm a football fan, yeah. Manchester United. <laughs> Probably I'll go down well with some people looking at this. <laughs> It's just through my father. He was always a Manchester United fan. The year I was born, they won the FA Cup, and that's the way it went. And my father, he was a, a manager of a restaurant. Well, my uncle is an electrician, so he is, and he would have took me sort of when I was 14 or 15 out, you know, sort of helping him, and I just got the interest for then. I left school and I've actually done uh, electrician work, so I did. I had done two years, and then the company uh, went bust. And it was around Christmas time, so I had to sort of get a job and I ended up in the uh, Ulster Carpets. Uh, I wasn't too happy about it, but you need to get on with things. So you do. So I applied for Ulster Carpets and started maybe, I'd say, eight weeks after. I wouldn't say it's a regret, no. I would like to work for myself. I enjoyed the, the, fun, the fun with all the classmates, but I wouldn't, I wouldn't have been a big, big fan of school itself. Really didn't get on with some of the teachers, things they got really. I look at seven or eight GCSEs, so I did. Well, I'd only wanted to become an electrician really after work, and I sort of got the exams that covered my getting on to the course. Uh, with working shift work, I wouldn't be a big fan of it, but when needs must, I sort of have to do. I have two boys, Dion and Tiano, four and six. It's, it's not easy, so it's not, to be honest with you. I wish I had maybe listened a bit better when I was their age. Stayed on, worked a bit harder, got a bit further on up the education ladder. M maybe I should have stayed on a bit longer. Yeah, with hindsight, yeah. But I wouldn't say it's a regret, no. I'm happy enough with the way my life is.